There has been an exciting revolution growing within the drumming community over the last several years. It's an A to E revolution, an acoustic to electronic revolution, where drummers are turning their acoustic drums into great electronic drums. And Extreme Drums may have actually started that revolution more than 20 years ago with easy to install internal drum triggers. And now today, a lot of drummers have turned their acoustic drums into more satisfying full-size electronic drums. Instead of using the small pads that the electronic drum companies have been offering us for more than 30 years. Hi, my name is Marshall from Extreme Drums. In this video, you're going to see some demonstrations showing you just how sensitive and dynamic Extreme Drums triggers really are. We're also going to show you how they compare with some of the other popular triggers on the market today. In the first video, I'll be dropping small, lightweight, airsoft BBs onto the mesh head of a converted snare drum. And then, I'll be playing that same snare drum with plastic drinking straws. Then, I'll play it with toothpicks. And then we'll be doing some comparisons between Extreme Drums triggers and some of the more popular triggers on the market today to show you just how Extreme Drums triggers outperform all the rest. My intention is not to put down other companies' products. There really are a lot of good triggers to choose from. My goal is to bring a greater awareness of the A to E revolution and what role Extreme Drums triggers have had in it. In the last several years, the A to E revolution has grown dramatically and has greatly transformed the drumming community. And now today, there are several online sites where you can get a lot of information about electronic drums or about converting your acoustic drums with do-it-yourself triggers or triggers made by other companies. But when it comes to being knowledgeable about electronic drums, there are very few people who know more about it than Justin from 65 Drums. His YouTube channel has over 50,000 subscribers now, and he posts new videos and reviews weekly covering just about everything that has to do with electronic drums. He currently has over 450 videos for you to choose from, Justin also has other 65 Drum social media sites where you can gain more knowledge as well as interact with other e-drummers online. I highly recommend checking out all the different things that Justin has to offer. There's really no way of knowing whether Extreme Drums triggers were responsible for causing the A to E revolution. And there's also no way of really knowing if I was the first drummer to start converting full-size acoustic drums into more satisfying electronic drums. But if I wasn't the first, I had to have been one of the first. I started making my own triggers and drum pads in 1992 and started converting acoustic drums shortly after that. One of the first drums that I converted was a Remo practice pad like this. Maybe some of you have done that too. Build a kick pad in the early 90s. Later when Roland came out with the V-drum heads, I converted a Remo pad with a V-drum head on it. Did several like that, made a few drum sets, converted 12-inch tom, that was my kick pad, and that was when Roland was still using this for their kick drum. Then when I started converting full-size drum sets, I started building triggers similar to this one, putting them inside the drums. Eventually, I started building triggers that mount on the edge of the drum because I didn't like hitting right in the center when you have a center-mounted trigger like a lot of people are still doing today. And if you're playing really delicate, and you happen to hit right on the center of the trigger, it's going to sound like you just really hit hard. And that's not always the best scenario. So I build triggers that mount over close to the edge. That way you're not hitting the trigger, you're getting the full dynamics of really what you're playing. In 1998, I took my Rogers drum set, a set that I had custom made in 1970 by Rogers Drum Company, and I converted it into a full-size electronic drum set and that forever changed my drumming experiences. Then in 2003 I put together the website extremedrums.com and I started selling converted drum sets with my custom-built internal triggers inside to drummers across the United States so that they could join the revolution also. Later I redesigned my triggers so that drummers could easily install them into their own drums. And now, after several improvements to my trigger designs through the years, Extreme Drums triggers are more sensitive and responsive than ever before. Here's the Airsoft BB demonstration. In 
And here's the plastic straw demo. And now, here are the toothpicks. Since I introduced my triggers more than 20 years ago, there have been several similar versions hit the market made by individuals and by other companies. Some of them are pretty decent. Some of them, not so much. Let's start with the Trigera trigger. They use the slotted bracket design that I came up with. It's a pretty good looking trigger, really. Um, performance wise, yeah, we'll show you. I've got a drum here that I've put a, an AB switch on. Inside, you can see I have one of my dual triggers. Here's the X1 head trigger. Here is the rim trigger. I'm going to be doing an AB comparison where we put one of the other competitors in this drum or clamped on the rim and we'll do an AB comparison with an Extreme Drums trigger. Okay, now we have Trigera installed in this drum alongside of the Extreme Drums trigger. And we'll do a comparison. Here's the Trigera trigger. Here's Extreme Drums trigger. Notice there's not dynamic range with the trigger. That's the best it'll get with extreme drums. Next we'll use a design that a lot of people are still using. Center mount cone with a, with a sensor right underneath of it. I'm going to put this in this snare drum and we'll compare that with Extreme Drums triggers. Now we have the crossbar installed with the cone sensor in the middle. We'll do an A-B comparison with that. First is the crossbar with the cone. Now we'll do the extreme drums trigger. As you can hear, extreme drums triggers give you a whole lot more dynamics. Again, here's the crossbar. okay but you don't you miss out on a lot of the variation from the extreme hits to the real soft grace notes again extreme drums okay now let's do some of the most popular clamp on triggers here is a Roland RT-30R, dual zone snare trigger. It's one of the mo more popular ones today. It's an okay trigger, um, but I liked Roland's earlier design they had years ago. The chrome clamp-on trigger, they actually worked a little better than these. So here's a response of the Roland trigger. just don't get the dynamics with that. Extreme drums. D-Drum is another company that's been building triggers for years. They have two different designs. Red shot trigger 
and the clamp on trigger. I'm going to put this one on the drum and we'll test that one. They both basically have the same sensors in them so we'll, we'll test this one. One of the drawbacks with the D-drum triggers you have to have a mic type cable to plug into these and they're not included with the trigger. You have to buy them separately. So here is the D-drum trigger. Extreme drum. D drum. You don't have the dynamics with those either. When you convert a drum set with Extreme Drums triggers, you really don't have to have a high quality drum set or even drums that match. For instance, this is a drum set that I pulled off the shelf here at the drum shop. They happen to be similar color, but we have Pearl Snare Drum, Pearl Toms, Ludwig Floor Toms, and a Mapex Bass Drum. And the drums that you use, especially if you're going to be using them for home practice, they could be different colors, they could be different types, it doesn't really matter. You can buy a used drum set from a garage sale, from eBay, from Facebook Marketplace. Oftentimes you can get a great deal on a shell pack from Guitar Center or from other local music shops. And then you can use the cymbal stands that you already have. Today there's a few companies out there that are selling complete full-size acoustic drum sets that have been converted into electronic drum sets. But you really don't have to spend a lot of money to convert an acoustic drum set into a great electronic drum set. You can quickly and easily convert a drum set with Extreme Drums triggers without drilling any holes, without soldering any wires. We even supply all the cables that you need. And it only takes about 15-20 minutes per drum to do it. You can even turn a valuable set of drums into great electronic drums without doing any damage to them at all. You can use it for quiet home practice, for practicing with a band, for playing live concerts, clubs, or even with a worship team at church. Or you could use your converted drums in the studio to record with and use sounds from your drum module or use software samples from great programs like Superior Drummer or Addictive Drums. Or you could even use a combination of both and blend the different sound samples. The sky's the limit. You can have a great looking electronic drum set that feels the way you want it with everything where you are used to having it not having to play on little pads but on a full size set of drums that feel right to you because they're your drums. So why don't you join us in the A to E revolution. Convert a drum set with extreme drums triggers, the triggers that may have actually started the revolution in the first place. We give you all the cables and connectors that you need to connect to the drum module that you're going to use. We also give you a 30 day satisfaction or money back guarantee. Plus, we give you a five-year warranty, so if anything would happen to any of your triggers, just let us know, send them back, and we will repair them or replace them free. So the bottom line is this. If you're going to convert a drum set, why not use the triggers that are going to give you all the sensitivity and dynamics that you really need? Wouldn't you want a set of triggers that will accurately reproduce what you play? All of these benefits are reasons why I'd recommend Extreme Drums Triggers if you're going to convert a drum set into the best electronic drum set that you've ever played. So come on, join us in the revolution and take your drumming to a whole new level with Extreme Drums Triggers. And then you can become an Extreme Drummer too.